Your WXII 12 forecast is always available on the free WXII 12 app. Stay connected with meteorologist Brian Slocum on his Facebook page. All right, 621 early on this Wednesday morning. Uh, temperatures have turned chilly once again early on, as they often do in the month of January. Uh, we've settled in in the mid to upper 20s over the majority of the area this morning with a spot or two in the 30s. It's cold. Uh, we have relatively light winds in place, but what wind we do have today will be out of the southwest, and that should warm temperatures above average. Typical temperatures for these middle days of January run in the upper 40s. We should reach the lower 50s and could even see a spot or two in the mid 50s later this afternoon. We've got some clouds, a little bit of light precipitation over um, Louisiana, southern Mississippi, moving into Alabama. Uh, this is tracking northeast and will likely bring at least some scattered clouds by late afternoon and or into the evening hours tonight. Those clouds could get quite heavy for a little while and could produce a few raindrops. Uh, locally, uh, it's producing some mixed precipitation in these early morning hours, but we should st still be warm enough and above freezing when that wave rolls in. A better one rolls in for Friday. Uh, this one could produce some rain. It doesn't look terribly wet, but a period of showers is possible during the day on Friday and then into Friday evening. Behind that, we have some cooler temperatures that will uh, set us up for the weekend with a chill in the air. Uh, in the meantime, temperatures uh, across the east and across the Midwestern states, uh, anywhere from the mid-20s to lower 30s. Uh, locally, we're in the upper 20s, Charlotte, Raleigh, Triad here. We're all reporting some upper 20s this morning. Uh, 25 in Boone, up a degree from last hour. Temperatures are, are as cold as 19 in Martinsville. That air is dry 22 in the heart of Rockingham County at Shiloh Airport. Uh, temperatures today should get up to around 53 degrees this afternoon. What wind we have will be relatively light out of the southwest at 5 to 10 miles per hour. Could be a good afternoon for a bike ride. Uh, make sure you layer up, though, for that. Uh, that will add certainly a chill to your day. 52 in the foothills with evening temperatures falling into the 40s and eventually 30s as those added clouds begin to move in. And across the mountain west, a high of 47 extra clouds by this evening. Here's your hour-by-hour -hour forecast. It shows you how this plays out. High, thin clouds begin to move in first. That band or that wave should miss us mostly to the south, but a few patchy light showers may be a possibility uh, as that storm system develops uh, mostly offshore. Uh, we're cool again tonight. We'll get milder tomorrow with highs in the mid to upper 50s. And then that front starts to approach. It will likely begin to move in Friday afternoon or evening. and could bring a few areas of rain into the area. Milder temperatures are expected February, March, and into April. Warmer and wetter than average conditions expected for late winter and early spring. So we have that to look forward to. After a milder stretch this week, it does get colder this weekend, and that will continue early next week, too.